Yes, it's Betty White, everybody! I think they're happy to see you, Betty, as I am myself. Well, I've, I've been noticing the last few times I've been on the show, we got kind of silly. So tonight I'm going to be very dignified and I'm going to be a little more serious. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, yeah. Very young. Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah, no, it's a, is, Are you all right there? You, is this chair too high? No, oh, I like it. Hold on, I, I have. I keep it no, on the stool here. No, I can't swing my on. legs if it's any lower. No, I, I like this. Oh, you do? Oh, I do. I like to swing my legs. Didn't I ever tell you that? Well, I'd heard a couple of cab drivers tell some <laughs> stories, but I. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, how are things over at Horton Cleveland? They all right? Okay. Well, yes, and when are you coming back to see? I, I don't know. I Soon, I hope. Will I, you please? Yeah. We, oh, I love it over everybody there. Everybody loved having you there. Well, I like being there, being had by all you girls. But you know, well, that, <laughs> but you know, the funny thing is, we knew you're wonderful at whatever it is you do here. <laughs> But we didn't know you were <laughs> We didn't know you were such a good actor. Oh please. Oh, they really oh is. please. I they, they were, I I had to play someone who had a murky past and a Scottish accent. Oh <laughs> <laughs> for which you got a stunt check. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's uh, right. Oh, yeah. Uh, mm. Hey, how are things? Were you didn't you go to Cleveland recently? You actually went there? I actually went What were you doing? You went to Cleveland? And I went to uh, Columbus just this last Columbus, week. Ohio? Yeah. With oh, that's the Paris of uh, the lower uh, Ohio Valley. Well, <laughs> well, but it's it's uh, Jack Hanna. Oh, Jack Hanna, the Animal friend. Man. So, yes. And so we're great and good friends. So I went to the the zoo, and he took me all through backstage, and I was holding koala bears, and I was holding cheetah babies, and I had the most wonderful time. Well, you know, Betty, I, I worried about you holding the cheetah babies, though. Cheetahs are, uh, you know, <laughs> that's quite an aggressive animal there. That could scratch you. Oh no, that's all right. He, uh, I mean, Jack went for my throat, but yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> well that's only because you were swinging your legs around. <laughs> hey. <laughs> yeah. Is that? <laughs> Have you ever, I always, I always wanted to ask you, do you ever, have you ever been with an animal and you thought, oh, this is a ho, because you love animals so much. Anything, right. anything. But have you ever uh, spent any time with an animal and thought, I don't care for this animal at all. I don't like it. Like, for example, a cat. Oh, a, a cat? Oh, yeah, for example, you know, a, a, an animal that you didn't like. For example, a cat. Oh, oh, how dare you even put it that way. Understanding. I mean, you're telling me you've never been attacked at all by an animal once, uh, even pecked by a bird or something. Um, one time I was hurt. The only time I've ever been hurt was by a swan of all they're things. They're vicious. No, they're uh, vicious. No, he. Well, I was I was driving through the country. Alan was doing a summer stock show, and I was driving out to see. It got it. in the car. So what? The swan. Did it get in the car? No. No. Oh. No. <laughs> So there was this beautiful river and a beautiful swan. So I stopped the car. I was all by myself, about in the middle of the country. And I stopped the car and got out and to walk down to the river to see this swan. Well, I didn't know he was married because there was all of a sudden out of left field over here, I must have walked by a nest. This swan came out and hit me 
with the, the upper part of his wing. It was like being hit with a baseball bat. He hit me right. They, they can really hurt you he that they're, have, yeah. He broken my leg. In fact, I thought it was broken. And then, then did he just leave you alone after that, or did he continue oh, no, to peck? Oh, no, that's all he, he was just telling me to get away from his nest, which I didn't know was there. So he was Wait, well, maybe, I, maybe I, I respectful. <laughs> 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 But it was, uh, and it was so silly, and I, when I got back to Alan and stuff, and I was limping and all that, what, what happened, honey? What, I got hit by a swan. <laughs> <laughs> it's so ridiculous. Well, you know, they, I mean, I've been, you know, I've been close to, you know, I've been in dangerous situations with swans before. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. There's a, there used to be a canal uh, near where I grew up, and swans would nest there, and we would go fishing, and they would, they would come by and peck. Yeah, 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 but they don't do it this much. It's it's usually with the wing, you know, this wing. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Yeah. That's, that's another thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> all right. Why don't we just keep it all contained? <laughs> Well, well, apparently we're out of time, Ben. I know, I know we're out of town. Mm. I love the way they call ahead, you know, when you're going to do the show and they ask you all kinds of questions, then we'll talk about this and we'll talk about that. We never talk about any of them. Well, to be fair, Betty, we've known each other longer than the producers on the show know, have known you, so, uh, you know, I don't need them to say, Betty's coming, you better talk about this. No, no, you don't need any of that. <laughs> You're Are you saying the opposite of what's true? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I promised I was going to be dignified tonight. I really did. Well, you can start. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we, we really are out of time. Do you want some chocolate or something? No, oh, no, I'm going to get out of your hair now because I can't swing my legs anymore and I can't, and I can't make any jokes, so I'm going home. <laughs> I feel your pain, Betty. I feel your pain. <laughs> Betty White, everybody, we'll be right back.